Morning, folks. How are we doing? So, Chantal, she's taken her leave like she said she was going to do. She's disappeared off the internet. Pete's, he's done exactly the same thing. It's definitely because they're getting ready for the big move. Not at all because they're avoiding all the allegations being levied against him right now. <laughs> Guys, how dare you? Uh, Amberlynn is... I don't know, probably, like, doing Instagram q and I don't have Instagram, so I have no way of checking, and I have no intention of setting up an Instagram just to say, just so I can look at her q and As. So I thought, why not? We'll go back, because Chantel's really pushing it. She's a season two trailer is out for the couple vlogs. Oh, she can't wait until the second they get back to q and She's going to be releasing all these vlogs about their love and everything. So I thought, why not? We'll go for the Romantic Odyssey, the three-parter, the Phylaka Island three-part series. Uh, you know, what, what other way to show their love? It's like, what... 40 minutes in total of screen time. I'm going to try and compress that down to about 30. So I guess that's my challenge. We're going to ply through this stuff. Probably going to be a 1.25 times speed. Let's go, guys. Hello, guys. Good morning. How are you doing? Hello. Hey, guys. Welcome back to another video. Oh, Today, I'm so excited to be back. Phylaka Island. Phylaka. Yeah, exactly. Yep. And we are going to... <laughs> he doesn't even look at her when he says it. I'm not going to try and pause too, too much. Because I guess I don't want to compress it down for you guys. Just so you guys don't have to watch all the porn. But but I just love... It's just pure eye contact with the camera. He had no point says he like look at her or anything like that. He doesn't give a fuck. Taking a boat there, so... Okay. So get ready for the boaties. Yay. Yella. 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 It's a rainy, foggy day. I'm really glad I got that two nanosecond close up of her face. I was this is what I it was what I was missing this afternoon. Hi, hi, baby. We are so excited. <laughs> what? Did he did he call the camera baby because he wasn't looking at her when he did it? <laughs> is he seeing himself in the viewfinder and <laughs> he was calling himself baby? <laughs> oh, that was so awkward. Oh God, bro. <laughs> hi, baby. <laughs> he's just like staring at the camera. Maybe he's maybe he's calling. Maybe maybe I'm his baby. Maybe I'm his baby. We're all his baby. <laughs> No problem. There's no matter. That is, that was a genuine laugh. That was a really genuine laugh there. Just, <laughs> oh, baby, that is funny. Baby, I appreciated that sense of humor. My my humor drive has been activated. Humor reading at 72%. <laughs> 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 that was amazing. And also, it has the Museum Palace of Sheikh Abdullah Subah. It would be interesting, babe. Yes, it's going to be very historical and educational. Wow, the one time he looks at her, it's like, to, like this is your cue to speak now, woman. <laughs> That's the one time he's actually made any form of my contact with her. I'm so glad. I'm so glad that you didn't put the music up over this. But like she's had other bits where the where the the recording was silent and it was music in the background. But now she's like letting us hear like the engine noises and her deep breathing. It's like I really appreciate that. Yeah. Hi. We're on the boat. It's so comfortable. It is, yeah, it's really nice. God, this is the inhuman diet. This is what I was joking about in my last video, where it's like two robots just trying to like form like general human like thought from like an AI bot. And it's like, this chair is comfortable. Yes, honey, I agree. The chair is comfortable. It is a nice view. Do you agree? Yes, honey, I agree. It is a nice view. <laughs> it's like, there's no, zero, like, genuinely zero chemistry. I'm sure everyone watching this has been on at least like one first date. And like I think with like a, a, like a first date with a total stranger who has like every day, like you could I don't know you could be a card carrying communist and you could sit down and the guy next to you could be wearing a maga hat and I guarantee you guys would have better chemistry than these two. <laughs> Did he just realize that she was laughing? He's like, oh, I must laugh too for the for the scene. Ha 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 ha. Can you maybe stand out on the deck when it's going? Like, I'm not sure. Like, obviously, the different puts of different rules. But I remember when I was in Japan, we took a, a tour of Tokyo Harbor, and you could stand out on the deck, and you just you always wanted to because like you're you're taking a picture through a window. Firstly, the her her, her picture quality is terrible. The, the window was too dirty, so you can't get, get it focused on there. Like, the, the building is too low down, so you don't really get a sense of scale for the building at all, because you mainly take, like, the picture is, like, I don't know, top 50% clouds. It should be, like, lower down, which is just, like, maybe about here. Maybe here would be the top of it. Uh, it's, it's just... <laughs> the, yes, guys, it is more interesting for me to describe the cinematography of, of, of taking this picture than it is for her, than me to talk about her just existing. Like I, you know, I, I know you got to play with the like the, the hand you're dealt, like, but 
It's this is terrible. This is terrible. I'm not going to show most of these. They're just like panning shots of just scenery, but it's like it's like rainy and foggy outside, and the windows dirty, and you can, you can barely see anything, and it's all just like. It, it's a, it's like she's like in Silent Hill. If anyone knows that reference, she's like she's in Silent Hill trying to film during one of the fog sequences. <laughs> I remember when I was when I was uh, in Japan, we went up um, to Hakone, uh, and we went to the top of like oh, I can't remember what mountain it was in Hakone, um, and it was like pure fog, like you barely see five feet in front of you. And I laughed my tits off because I was like, that is so funny. <laughs> that is so funny. We we took all this time to go up this mountain, which already had beautiful views, and you couldn't see anything it was hilarious it was generally funny like it was a funny experience just because of that because the effort we took and it, we, we you're getting really nothing out of it but it was also, it's actually a really good memory to me this like you're try, i wouldn't sell the footage i recorded how can i and try and make it seem like a really cool interesting vlog because it's like this this is what you're seeing <laughs> Christ, the fucking music came, like, the noise came in like a jump scare there. And Sal's voice, like, 200 meters in the background going like, Hey, Bear, do you like the witch? Yes, I like the witch. <laughs> need life jackets. <laughs> what, do, what do you need, life jackets? <laughs> really? You need life jackets to walk from the boat to the shore? <laughs> Jackets. The bridge we're about to walk on moves a lot, so in case we fall in the water. Hi, babe. <laughs> Hi. How are you gonna fall in the water? Do you, can you fall six feet across? <laughs> How the fuck would you fall in the water? <laughs> Shouldn't laugh. I did though. <laughs> Yo, be careful. It's moving. <laughs> uh -huh. How would you fall overboard? There's like six feet between you and the water and a like a fence. <laughs> what? Duffel <Double> dunk. <laughs> <laughs> I love. I love, he's not even like holding her hand or helping her or anything like that. He's, he's in no way is he being supportive at all. He is filming her and laughing at her. <laughs> that is so, that's so good. That's the kind of thing I would do, but I'm not pretending to be like the most in love, like, oh my God, baby, oh, I love you, baby, kind of thing of all time. Yeah, okay. it's moving a lot. Yeah. No, it's not stable. Oh. Is, he, is he talking about her or the bridge? <laughs> There's a lot of movement there, love, you don't look stable. Hey, cat, yellow. Nice. Wow. No way. This has been a this has been incredible comedy so far. It's just them walking down, looking at chairs, going, "Oh, there's chairs here. Oh, oh, oh there's some chairs here, guys. Oh, oh, there's some chairs here." Like t three different times. We are in the Maldives, right? I think so. Yeah, the Maldives is generally like rainy and overcast and really unattractive. Bro, it's like it's it's just it's like a, it's like a hay hut. <laughs> That's it. I don't think it doesn't scream Maldives to me. So many places to relax here. Holy shit, this is genuinely like the the fifth seating arrangement they have shown and being like, look guys, there's seats. Do you know what, Chantel? I get it. I get it at this stage. You, I don't I don't need any more. Me and you. I'm starving, Gilla. Let's go eat. That's what I like to hear. Oh yay, more seating arrangements, my favorite! So yeah guys, that's the first video done. We're back to the second one. A couple of vlogs that felt like a Island Q8 Part Two and in Arabic, uh, yeah. I guess that. I guess that the first video was something. Uh, we saw them have no chemistry, get on a boat, be on a boat, and then getting off a boat, and then looking at chairs. Uh, it's sad that that is a very accurate representation of that entire ten-minute video, uh, because I do think about three minutes of it. It was dedicated to looking at different seating areas. Uh, so I, let's just go straight into the next one. So when we got off the bus, we just followed the crowd into this building, okay. which turned out to be the reception area. So oh yeah, yay! More seating areas, my favorite content. Side the reception area, so we're here, and we're gonna go eat. <laughs> and also, we can visit the museum after we eat in the restaurant. For some of the video, I'll have to do a voiceover because they were playing copyrighted music. But we chose to eat at this restaurant, <laughs> which had a variety of different food: Kuwaiti food, Middle East. See. One of the biggest things that makes her look so unhealthy, I'm going to make a point, is because of the sheer size of her, um, because she is so front heavy, she has to lean back 
So it always looks like she's like re repulsed by everything that's in front of her. So it anytime you see her walking like naturally, she walks with like a C curve. Because, you know, our arse is here, and she doesn't really have much of an arch, um, but she's so front-heavy that it pulls her forward. So naturally, she would lean forward, but she's trying to stand up as straight as possible, which must which must ruin her back, honestly, um, because of the, the natural bend. So uh, that, that's uh, that's my um, that's my thesis on um, <laughs> on the curvature of Chantel's spine, I guess. ...of different food, Kuwaiti food, Middle Eastern food, French fries, sandwiches, shawarma, things like that. Match they got Middle Eastern food, other Middle Eastern food, lots of Middle Eastern food, French fries, lots of Middle Eastern food. <laughs> I, wa I wonder what you're hungry for. <laughs> just, just create. And a big beauty bite, just for you guys. Yum. Yum. And a big beauty bite, just for you guys. Yum. <laughs> what an unnatural way to fucking speak. My husband totally exposed me here for picking. My husband, my husband totally exposed me here, guys. I'm on the pita chip. He totally exposed me, guys, because I had a, I had a, a chip, guys. Guys, like I know I look I look really dainty. I know I'm look really dainty. I'm like 110 pounds, guys. I need to lose the weight. I'm like 110 pounds. I'm a meant to be like a 95 pound kind of girl, but he totally exposed me. I had like one extra potato chip. Like, oh my god, bro. The only way he could expose you is if you had four cheeseburgers instead of three. Like, I'm sorry. Fuck off. For some. Yum. Enjoy, babe. Thank you, baby. Enjoy your food. Thank you. I will enjoy my food. I hope you also enjoy your food. Thank you, baby. I also hope I enjoy my food. Christ. God. Like, fuck me. Uh, I'm so dry. I'm, I, 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 don't know. I don't know what you girls watching this feel like, but like I feel like I'm chafing just sitting still. I'm that fucking dry. Holy actual shit. There is literally no chemistry here. I think someone could fuck a toaster easier than they could fuck each other. And here we have the Museum of Sheikh Abdullah Salim Palace. Okay. We also have cannons. Those are kind of cool. Let's visit it. Yeah. God, the deep breathing is essential. Look at the cannon. There are two of them, but you know, I get, I get what you're going for. Cool. <laughs> okay, yellow. Oh my Christ, the deep breathing is amazing. Holy shit. She is so. She's huffing and puffing like. She's about to blow this museum down. <laughs> Christ. Hi. Babe, are these the sheiks? Did she just say hi to the picture of these guys? <laughs> hi, guys. How are you? Um, I'm Chantal. <laughs> I really like the Caesar salad. What? <laughs> are you talking to a picture? Every history has a bunch of people on a boat struggling, and they make history. Very brave people, of course. You just, what was that? The, her, her, she looks at a picture and goes like, mm, yes, every, every history has uh, a bunch of people on a boat struggling heroically. And it's like... What? <laughs> what does that even mean? They could be fishermen for all you... F what the fuck are you talking about? You make it sound like these guys are landing at Normandy. <laughs> Bro, they, they could just be some fishermen. We have, we know nothing about this. Sheikh Abdullah Salim Boom. Huh. Simple fit. And a big radio. You know, old radio. If you guys like at, at any point hear like a loud thud and there's silence for the rest of it, know that I, that is me falling asleep and headbutting my desk on the way down, and I probably, I probably would just bleed out. Honestly, I don't think Goober here would really do much to to wake me up. She's sleeping actually. Um, she's actually having a good time. I'm recording slightly earlier because I'm away from work a wee bit early, like so. I, I she doesn't think it's time yet. So sorry, she might not appear in this in this episode. Um, crisis is born. This is it is it's so boring. It's like here here here's a room. This is a room where a bunch of people would sit and hang out and, and ha ha have tea. Oh, here here's a room. This is a guy. It would be a guy's bedroom. I was like, okay. I I, I I just don't. I just couldn't pretend to care. Yes. He had a doll. <laughs> okay. Here we have the old kitchen. Oh wow. <laughs> here we have the kitchen. Oh wow. Do you know what, Chantel? Me and her are actually with the same wavelengths here. This is the worst museum I've ever seen. It is It is just like, here's some rooms. And there's some stuff in them. It's like, okay. Cool, I guess. 
I've had to turn these guys up again. I'm sorry, I'm just back because I had to turn these guys up again because I, I don't know what is with Chantel's videos, but they're so quiet so often. And this, this is at 350% boosted because the audio is so poorly done in these couple vlogs. Do you sit? Do you sit in the family room? <laughs> oh, oh, guys, it's a room where people sit. Fuck, this is a, this is a terrible museum. One out of ten, wouldn't visit. Oh my Christ, that was that was unbearable. How long was that? That was. Two solid minutes of just panning over photographs. Because she said herself, oh, I'm just going to play music over this and just show you the photographs. So feel free to pause it and just read them if you want. And it was two solid minutes then of just panning over photographs. That was that was actual torture. Uh, thank God. It's Kuwait's ruler's room, though. I'm going to say there might be a place. There might, it, might be, it might be a sitting room. Let's go. You have to duck. <laughs> no, no. It's so once again, at the same more... time, we just... Oh my Christ, not again. This is what she said last time. Once again, to save time, we're just going to show you the photos. Feel free to pause if you want to. How long does this fucking go on for? Oh my Christ. It's like a, it's like a minute. Um, I don't care. Okay. This might be interesting. I do like some weapons. Look at this one. What is, okay, Chantal, let you tell me in any way what is different about that gun compared to what are the other guns. In any way. Apart from like that, looks like a flintlock. Apart, apart, apart from that, Chantal, in your own words... What is what is different about any of these like repeaters? By the way, it's how to get weapons. Is that a grenade? No. Oh. What? <laughs> I, I like. The, did you hear my voice and Sh uh, and Salah's voice? We matched. We were like confused. No. It, it's it, it's for fucking carrying black powder. I don't know. Seriously, if anyone guys know what this. It's for carrying black powder. Just write it in the comments. Thank you. Wow. It's a well. I see a well on my eyes. Is he being serious? Because even I've seen a well. Like, are you are you being serious, bro? Be careful, your phone. <laughs> what does this stand? I don't. I don't think she could. I love he checked how sturdy that was. <laughs> Maybe he had a little flash. and was like, I wonder if she has life insurance. Well, do you think she has travel insurance? Do you think Salah like saw dollar signs there and was like, oh, no one will ever know. People just think gravity finally got her. <laughs> So this was their water source. No! Fuck. Ch Chantel, geography teacher over here. Two hours. God, you guys are comedy gold. You guys are so funny. Like, he couldn't even do that in a funny way. He couldn't even pull out, for fuck's sake, look at his watch. He, like, struggled to look at his watch. Like, one on the server was, like, jammed up in his fucking arm or something like that. And he couldn't lift the watch right. Later. I think they're on vacation since like the 80s. Maybe no, they are boating bees. <laughs> boating bees. <laughs> no, let's have a seat. <laughs> yeah, oh, yay. Another seat. I can't wait. I'm so happy. We got to include another fucking seat in this adventure. Hello, guys. We are extremely enjoying this beautiful island for real. Me and my beautiful wife. <laughs> Bro, could you say with any amount of conviction? <laughs> Christ, God! I should say that line was attempted murder because he nearly fucking took me out there. Holy actual shit! Oh, God! Oh, the lack of conviction there was so fucking funny. It's 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 like you know if you have like an uncle who has like really bad teeth and he goes like I have a nice smile, don't die, and you're like uh, yeah, you've got a great smile, uncle. It was that tone of voice. Okay guys, third and final video, we're heading to the lake and the zoo, because why not, why wouldn't we go to the zoo again? I've always been curious who these videos are actually for, because like, Chantel like, is treating them like this is for like, a brand new audience, but Chantel's not that stupid, like, does she not realise that like, no one watches these, no one follows her here or there, they're so negatively received, that, like, I don't know why she wouldn't have just tried to start a brand new channel, apart from she knows like, literally no one would watch them then. But it's like they're so negatively received that they're not going to show up in the algorithm because they have more than a 50% dislike ratio. They have the hell, most of them have more than a, an 80% dislike ratio. They're never going to show up in the algorithm. 
So I, I, don't, I don't know. Um, let, let's just get in. This is the longest one yet, 17 minutes. Let's go. The entrance of the zoo and the lake. Let's go, guys. Let's go. <laughs> oh, they gave us bread. Okay, let's spread it out. See, I can speak Arabic. The guy specifically said, no, this isn't for you. This is for the deer, okay? Okay? <laughs> oh, look at here. Hi. Okay, um, we got a minute and a half of her feeding uh, deer. That was in invigorating. I think it's an emu. Hi. Yeah. Oh, they bite you. See, I'm just being like being straight up here, like you know, being, being nice and all. Like she looks like awful, like m mainly because like you know, like her her, her size doesn't help. Okay, like, being very direct, her size does not help. She looks awful. If she was wearing like a, because I, I know she got a floral one recently that she was gonna like try to wear, like and it probably will look better. But I think she'd look better in something a wee bit more colorful because right now she looks like an actual black hole. Like coming at you. I'm sure the geese and the emu double take and are like, holy shit, it's daytime. Why has the moon arrived here in my vision? Like, it, just wear something nicer, prettier. Like, you know, put a little bit of effort into how you look. Because right now you look fucking ridiculous. I'm just keeping you guys up to date. Because I know you guys are really curious what animals she fed at what time. Uh, yeah, it's like a, a like a minute 45 on deer and a minute and a half on, on emus. Bro, could you just stop deep breathing into the fucking camera? Like, that, that is 50% of this particular video so far. It's just her deep breathing. I'm not going to show you guys all of it, but it's just her staring at animals and deep breathing at them, and I'm sure that it really makes them uncomfortable. Welcome to the island. We've already been to the island. This has, like, been two minutes and then just walking around silently. That, that, that is it. It's been walking around filming buildings for two minutes silently. This where are stores and shops, you know? And this was cool. Yep. You've shown us all this before, just with no voiceover. Guys, this place... <laughs> she looks like she is hating her life. <laughs> Holy actual shit. Uh, this, has been so, this has been so boring. It has been walking around, just filming random buildings. And in the last 30 seconds, they've been given voiceover where they're like, this is a destroyed building. This is a destroyed building. And that, that is it. This has been, this has been, this has been torture. This is so cool. Try to remember all this footage I'm showing is at 1.25. I was trying to put it up to 1.5 speed, but I'm trying to be trying to be generous to them here. Got this has been like four minutes straight of just wandering around looking at like burnt buildings. Oh. Very sad. Yeah. Very sad. Yeah, <laughs> because this is—I don't know how much, if any, of I'm—I'm I'm going to show you this because this has actually been tortured to sit through, and it's, it is—it is just I'm walking around filming burnt out, damaged buildings for the past. I don't—I fuck, I have no way. Five minutes now, it has been—it's been absolutely dire. Let's check some fossils. I—I just. Uh, all, 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 all that's happened is I'm just walking around looking at empty classrooms, being like, this is an empty classroom. This is an empty classroom. As Chantel just deep breathes in the background. That is that that is this entire video. There's a smoky smell in the air. You want to go up here? You. Probably from your fucking thighs rubbing together, trying to walk this fucking much. Jesus Christ! Do you really do you think it's do you think the place is still on fire? The war happened thirty years ago. Calm sound. If this doesn't make you believe in God, I don't know what will. What your inability to walk? The fact that there's a school beside the ocean, bro. <laughs> what the the. the very mid-level clouds, bro, like, you're really stretching here to be as like, look how holy and religious I am now. Bro, it's like some fucking clouds. Calm your tits. The world is beautiful. 
Yeah, as you stand there in bombed out ruins, you have walked through bombed out ruins for seven solid minutes, and then you come out and go like, oh, wow, there's proof God exists because clouds, because uh, the world is beautiful. Bro, look at, look at just, look at the bottom of your frame. Hi, baby. Hello, honey. <laughs> so nice to be here with you today. Same here, baby. I, I, I concur in your assessment that it is it is nice to be here today. I am glad that you concur, for I decided to put forth the motion that it is quite good that we are together in such an auspicious area. Ah, oh, baby, that is good, for I agree with you. <laughs> you guys fucking suck at this fake chemistry shit. The sun. I'm so t if I if I could just walk into my computer screen, I would just walk into the ocean there, uh, to just to escape the next five minutes of this shit. I'm gonna have to sit through. Ruin school. Flip. Ooh. <laughs> it's a nice flip, right? Yeah. <laughs> I'm thirsty. <laughs> Did you see that? Did you see that? Holy shit, that's funny as hell. Okay, look at the distance between the two of them here. Just keep the keep the distance in mind between the two of them. <laughs> She tries to step in closer to him. Nice flip, right? Yeah. Step in close. Step away. <laughs> oh my god, you got shot the fuck down. <laughs> oh my god. That's so embarrassing for you. Oh Christ. Oh. oh, the romance is real, guys. She tried to step in close to him and he immediately stepped away. It's like, love, I'm sorry. You haven't, you haven't, you haven't paid enough. You, you, you have the, the no contact pass package. <laughs> Oh Christ, that's so fun! Oh, you got BTFO would love. Okay, let's go and bring water. Yeah, we wanted to explore more of the school first. No, you didn't. You specifically said you didn't want to. Like literally a minute ago, you said you didn't want to. So stop lying. I think I think Salah told you he wanted to go back in. Oh yay! More seating areas. My favorite. I'm gonna try the swing. So Sala went to get water for us, and he's back with a few bottles. We're on this swing thing. It's fun. Wee. Wee. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. I, I really do think that, that analogy of like the car carrying communists and the MAGA hat, people sitting down having more chemistry than this, I think that's 100% accurate. This is like, this is the driest, this is the driest shit I've ever seen. It, 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 it's there's it, it less chemistry and like sexual energy than if your two 90 year old grandparents got together and decided to go to the bingo together. Oh, the air, so nice. Oh. <laughs> Every single time she tries to get closer to him, he moves further away. Every single time and by the way that he was t turning there and she was trying to like hurriedly follow him to stay in frame i thought he was guiding her to try and get her to fall off the pier there yeah, okay. oh my god they're holding hands the love is finally real she must have pulled out the checkbook <laughs> <laughs> so cute <laughs> okay guys thanks for watching and i hope you enjoy with us and there's some information uh, about the history of Fayalik island Yes, guys, it was a pleasure to have you come along with us. Why do you, why do you have such a long pause, like you're waiting for like your turn in the script, from like to squeeze your hand and be like, your turn, go. See you in the next video. Bye, guys. Take care. Masalama. God, that was terrible. Uh, so yeah, that was uh, awful. I, I don't know if I'm going to really cover too much of Chantal from going on. I thought this would be a fun little thing to like show you guys what to look forward to, that we're going to be heading back to the couple's vlogs. Um... Christ, <laughs> it's just so bad. It's so bad, honestly. I, I'm probably not going to include like any of this last video because this last video was genuinely painful. Uh, I've recorded about an hour's worth here. Um, I'm going to try and cut it down, so it's about half an hour. So, um, yeah, it's just terrible. But I'm like I said, probably not going to cover a huge amount of um, Chantel in the future uh, because of that. I'm assuming she's just going to ignore all the all the allegations and all the issues. Well, we'll see. We'll see. I'll keep an ear out, see what the drama is, and if anything funny pops up, I might cover it here. I want to quickly thank my patrons, Frank, Eswank, Healy, Blake D. I'm just saying an absolute massive thank you so much for donating, supporting, all that malarkey. Thank you so much for watching and everyone for subscribing and watching and all. I have no idea what number of subscribers we're on. I haven't looked and I, I think we're we're like 750 or something like that. So pretty, pretty outstanding. So yes, guys, I'm going to leave you here. Have a good one. Take care of yourselves.
Bye-bye.